What's going on everybody? I'm back with another high risk coin booster video for you all today. And in today's video we're going to be doing a seven million dollar buy-in. And they gave us uh, 400 quarters to get started today. Pretty expensive game. But uh, luckily they gave us plenty enough quarters to get going. So wish me the best of luck. Hopefully we can knock down all these humongous towers they have in there today. Let's see, on the pusher back there, there's two massively tall towers made out of $10,000 chips. And uh, look at this great big old tower right here in the center. That is insane. It's definitely one of the biggest uh, poker chip and quarter towers I've seen in there before. It has a whole bunch of quarters on top of it. And uh, they got like two quarter pyramids on the left and the right corners. And they got like... Uh, two gold towers on the left and the right hand side. There's a couple dice on top of those. Oh nice, we got some quarters off of the right side. Check that out. So yeah, it's moving along just fine so far. That's a good sign. Oh my goodness, nice. That gold tower just fell straight down into the payout chute. And I think we got a white dice also. So yeah, uh, those white dice, we'll get to roll them at the end of this game. Whatever they land on, my winnings will multiply by those numbers. Oh yeah, this tower's about to go. Come on. Oh my goodness. Wow. That was awesome right there, baby. Holy moly, I was not expecting it to go that quick. And check this out, there was a pink Mr. Bag hidden in there. Wow, holy smokes, that was amazing. So uh, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed that uh, tower falling down. Yeah, that was exceptional. And on top of that, the uh, two towers on the pusher, those are getting pretty close to going as well. So that is absolutely marvelous right there. So anyhow... Uh, that right there was the last of our 400 quarters that we started with, so uh, let's go round up the quarters right quick, and uh, we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, I'm back. So before we get back to pushing, I would like to go ahead and open up this uh, pink mystery bag right here. Feels like it's pretty heavy, so let's see if there's any nice and valuable prizes in there. Oh my gosh, wow, we got the $5 chip. And uh, five of the $1 chips today. And we also got the $50 chip. So this $50 chip right here, uh, we'll get to cash that in at the very end of this game right here. They'll take everything that's falling down those uh, side slots right there. They'll put it all back into the play field for us to have a second chance of winning it. So that is incredible. And uh, each one of these $1 chips is worth 500 free quarters. So that's 2,500 extra quarters right there. That is exceptional. And the $5 chip, we'll get to turn that in. Uh, they'll take all the stuff that is on the uh, blue shelves and they will put it all into the play field. So, yeah, we got incredibly lucky with that Mr. Bag right there. So, uh, yeah, if that uh, $5 chip wouldn't have been in there today, then we'd have had to have paid two times the original buy-in to get them to uh, take all that stuff off the blue shelves and put it into the play field. So, it saves us from having to pay $14 million to get the stuff off the blue shelves. Anyway, them two towers on the pusher, they're super close to going. Let's go ahead and load up the quarters extremely high back there on the pusher. Try to get a large base of quarters stacked up behind them. That should get them moving fairly quickly, I guess. So anyway, they got a lot of stuff on the blue shelves today, as you can see. Yeah, those brown and white towers that they have in there on the blue shelves, those are all uh, $25,000 chips. So that is some pretty good money right there. I'd say each one of those towers is like one and a half, two million, possibly. It's just my prediction. We'll find out later on after we win it. And uh, they got two of the ginormous uh, dollar sign money mystery bags in there. Those look like they're loaded up super good. Oh yeah, nice. Oh yeah, jackpot baby. We got the one on the left. Wow, look at all that money we're winning. Oh my gosh, this is doing incredible today. Wow, it just keeps on going and going and going. Let's push on the right side now. Try to get that ginormous tower over there to get going. Oh my goodness, wow, look at all that money. 
It is unstoppable. Look at all those $10,000 chips just flying out of there. Yeah, I thought I heard the manager talking. Uh, yeah, the manager said something after I did the $7 million buy-in. He said something to one of the employees. I'm trying to remember exactly what he said. I mean, I was already a pretty good distance away from him when he said this. He was like, uh, so I want you to make sure you do everything you can to make sure he doesn't walk out of here with a profit today. So he said that, what the manager said. So uh, obviously the manager wants me to lose a lot of money. So uh, that's just motivated me even more to get the whole entire machine cleared out. When every single chip, every single gold bar out of there. Let's go for the biggest win possible on this game. Yeah, let's go for a brand new record win. That would be incredible. Alright, there we go. Had to get that loose shoot cleared out. It was getting pretty full. Yeah, for the ones who don't know, if you happen to be new to the channel, there's this little, like, opening area, like, right up above the uh, payout chute. And if it gets too full and it starts to uh, boil over with chips and gold and quarters and whatnot, sometimes it will, like, fall down that little opening area and it will actually go inside the machine and it would go to the exact same location as those uh, side slots on the left and the right-hand side. And that would go to the house. I would not get to win or keep any of that. But luckily today we got that $50 chip. So all that stuff that we've lost today, they'll put that back in here for us. Which is pretty fortunate if you ask me. And uh, this golden tower right here with the dice on it, that looks like it might be a little difficult to win. So, uh, I don't know. Let's just push on the left side for a little bit. See, I think the problem we're facing right now, uh, this quarter pyramid right here, it's like super super heavy and if that doesn't get moving then there's no possible way we're going to get this gold tower right here so that's the only obstacle we're dealing with at the moment and we're about out of quarters anyway we got probably about uh, 40 or 50 of them left in the bowl I'll have to go down there and round up the quarters again all right let's see what this push right here does that's the last of the quarters right there Come on, nice push, big money. All right, so let's go see what we've won so far, and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, I'm back. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and turn in this $5 chip, and all five of these $1 chips right here, they'll give me 2,500 extra quarters, and they'll put all that stuff that is on the blue shelves here into the playing field, so we'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turn in that $5 chip, and all five of those $1 chips, they gave me uh, 2,500 extra quarters. And they uh, put all that stuff that was on the blue shelves into the play field. Oh no, well it looks like we lost a whole bunch of uh, $5,000 chips to the blue shelf over there on the right hand side. So uh, yeah, that $50 chip later on, whenever we cash that in, that will come with a free reset. And they'll put those $5,000 chips that we lost back into the play field for free. Won't cost us any money at all. But say if there was no more uh, special chips in there, then it would cost double the original buy-in. So it would be, uh, well actually no, not double the original buy-in, it would just cost a hundred grand to have them put those $5,000 chips back into the play field. I apologize, I was thinking of uh, what it would cost if the $5 chip was not in there. So anyhow, uh, let's stack up the quarter super, super high back there on the pressure. Yeah, that other uh, $25,000 chip tower is about to go. Nice, there we go, we got a dice, oh my goodness. Wow, it's just raining out of there now. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I got that loot chute cleared out. Yeah, I think one of the uh, mystery bags got stuck in there. And uh, it was blocking a lot of stuff from falling down. So anyway... Hopefully we can win all these $25,000 chips. Nice, there we go. 
We got another mystery bag. Let's get it cleared out of the loot chute again. Oh my goodness, wow, that was a waterfall. Massive waterfall with $25,000 chips. Yeah, all those uh, $25,000 chips add up super, super quick. It only takes four of those to make $100,000, so... Yeah, you just know it's going to be a huge payday when they got the $25,000 chips in there. So I tell you what, let's rapid fire a bunch of quarters in there and see what happens. There we go. That was a whole entire basket of quarters at once. Let's see what it does. Come on, work some magic. Well, we just about got the center all cleared out, pretty much. Nice. There we go. Now we just got to uh, worry about these two ginormous uh, golden towers they have in there. And uh, I will open up both of the money mystery bags later on. We will uh, open it up on camera together, so uh, stay tuned for that. Hopefully them mystery bags are jam-packed full of goodies and stuff like that. It'd be nice to get a couple more of the special chips, like the uh, $10 chip, 5,000 slash 10,000 chip. Any one of those would be great, so. Anyway, let's see. Yeah, these two golden towers look like they're going to give us a battle. If we could just get that one on the right to fall like straight backwards, we'd be able to push all the gold out of there quite easily, I guess. So uh, let's try for the right hand side on this push right here. I'll probably try, I'll finish out all these quarters we got and if we don't get these gold towers. I might just go ahead and turn in the $50 chip. And they would probably rearrange both of the gold towers whenever I turn in the $50 chip. So. There's a chance they could put those in locations that would be easier to win. Like maybe in the center or something. Who knows? Now we definitely got the quarters stacked up super, super high in there, but we're not getting much movement on the uh, towers on the corners, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't want to waste all the quarters before we turn in the uh, $50 chips, so... Just going to finish out all these quarters that I have in the basket up here. Then we will uh, check out the two ginormous Dollar Sun Money Mystery Bags. Yeah, it's always super, super exciting opening up those uh, Dollar Sun Mystery Bags because they could be loaded up really, really good, potentially, so... And it'd also be nice to get a bunch more of those uh, white dice. And like I said, those white dice, we'll get to roll those at the end of this game. And uh, whatever they land on, that will uh, multiply our winnings by all those numbers. So. But yeah, if you don't know how uh, rolling the dice works, if this is your first time watching the videos, uh, what they'll do, they'll put all them dice that we went on the pressure back there. And we have to roll them on down to this lower... Uh, play field, lower shelf, whatever you want to call it, and uh, whatever's facing upwards, uh, that's our uh, winning numbers right there. But if any of them land on ones, then those would not count at all. The ones are technically zeros. There's three different types of dice that are in there. There's white dice, gold dice, and silver dice. The white dice, those obviously multiply my winnings. I've been said that two or three times. And uh, the gold dice, that would multiply the gold bars. So say we've won 100 ounces of gold and that uh, gold dice lands on a 5. We'd turn that 100 ounces of gold into 500 ounces of gold. So that's how that works. And the silver dice, I guess you can uh, guess that. That would multiply our uh, quarters by whatever it lands on. Oh wow, this is pushing super, super good. We're getting all those quarters back that we stacked up. Yeah, I'm just trying to uh, win as many quarters back as possible. Because uh, sometimes whenever we turn in some special chips, they like to level out the play field. And uh, a lot of times they'll take all those quarters for themselves. We definitely don't want that to happen, so... 
Now once we get all those quarters like off of the right side there, see how it's super, super piled up right through there? If we can just uh, get all those quarters out of there, I'll go ahead and turn in the $50 chip. All right, so we got a couple quarters left. All right, last handful right here. There they are. Come on, we need a nice push. Come on, baby, big money. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. So, anyway, let's go ahead and open up the two mystery bags. How does that sound? Alrighty, I'm back. So, here's both of these ginormous dollar sign money mystery bags. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and open up this one over here on the left. Uh, let's see if there's any nice and valuable prizes in there. It definitely feels like it's loaded up pretty good. So, let's see what we got. Oh, my goodness, it's really, really full. Wow, check this out. We got a whole bunch of uh, $25,000 chips. Let's get these out of the way real quick. Let's see how many of them we got. Oh my goodness, there's a whole bunch of dice also. Check that out. A whole bunch of white dice and gold dice. So it uh, looks like we got 250 grand in a $25,000 chip. So I'll take it. And uh, let's see, we got uh, four of the white dice and four of the golden dice. That is absolutely exceptional right there. Yeah, I can already tell you this is going to be a massive win today. That's guaranteed. So now let's move on to this other one right here. Yeah, this one feels like it's loaded up about the same. Uh, what do y'all think's in there? Can you see anything? I'm not looking at it just yet. Just letting you all get a sneak peek of what's in there. So let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, it is super, super full. I might end up dropping some of this stuff on the floor. We'll see. Oh my goodness. Nice. Check this out. We got a whole bunch of uh, $5,000 chips. Let's get those out of the way first. Oh wow, we got some more dice. Two ounces of gold also. So let's see what we got. 10 grand, 20 grand, 30 grand, 40 grand in $5,000 chips. I'll take it. We also got two more ounces of gold, four more uh, white dice, one silver dice, and one gold dice. That is absolutely magnificent right there. That is awesome. Yeah, both of them Mr. Bags were loaded up brilliantly well. So anyhow, that's not bad, not bad at all. I'm going to go ahead and turn in that $50 chip. They'll take everything that we've lost to them side slots. They'll put it back into the playing field. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $50 chip. Uh, they took all the stuff that had fallen down in the gutters today and they put it all back into the playing field. Wow, this is loaded up incredibly well. They got a ginormous sour on the pusher back there. Uh, looks like it's made out of five, ten, and twenty-five thousand dollar chips. It has a gigantic basket of quarters sitting on top of it. Who knows? There might be something hidden underneath all those quarters back there. You never know. So uh, all those quarters that you're seeing in that basket is more than likely the quarters that had uh, fallen down in the gutters today. And uh, I definitely don't remember losing this much stuff to the gutters, especially all the gold. So uh, this pretty much indicates that one or more people had been playing on this machine before I got here today. And other people had lost stuff to the gutters, and I was the first person to win that $50 chip. So uh, wish me the best of luck. Hopefully we can get it all cleared out of there. Oh nice, there we go. We got the mystery bag to go already. Sweet. Oh yeah, here it is. So we'll check that thing out here in a little bit. So uh, stay tuned for that. Wow, this is doing super, super well so far. So uh, anyway, if this is your first time watching my channel and you're enjoying this awesome video right here and you want to see more videos like this, uh, seven days a week, 365 videos every single year, uh, be sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, enable that bell icon. That way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video. It would help out tremendously. We're on the road to 200,000 subscribers. My goal is to get there by the end of this year, actually. And uh, we recently got to 150,000 subscribers. So uh, once again, thank you all so much for getting me to 150,000 subscribers. I truly appreciate that. Yeah, I appreciate all the support over the past couple of days, and over the past couple of weeks. The videos have been doing uh, a million percent better. The views are going back up to where they should be, like 30, 40,000 views every single day on each video. And the likes are going up. Y'all seem to be hitting that like button a lot more now. So 
I mean, that really just says that my videos are doing better, so I guess my videos are starting to get more and more entertaining. That's my goal, anyway. I try to make the most entertaining content out there. So, uh, if you want to see... Well, let's just say, if you have any suggestions for types of videos you'd want to see, let me know down in the comment section. That would really uh, help out the channel. Just uh, let me know your suggestions down in the comments. And if you have suggestions for, like, different types of towers that could be built in here, just let me know, and I will let the staff know your all suggestions. So, yeah, just let me know down in the comments. So that right there was around 1,100 quarters at once. Oh yeah, this tower on the right side, it's about to go. That's going to get it for sure. Oh my goodness. Well, that one fell over there on the right. That is awesome sauce right there. It looks like a bunch of our uh, quarters got stuck back there behind the glass. Hopefully they'll break loose here in a second. And check that out. There's also uh, two golden towers with some $25,000 chips on top of them on the blue shelf, so now that right there just indicates there's either a $5 chip or a red earbud inside of that uh, ginormous dollar sign mystery bag that we had won. And uh, whenever I win that, they'll put them two towers into the play field, and they might possibly uh, do a, a free reset on the machine. They might rearrange some of these towers that are in here, which would be amazing. So uh, while all those quarters are breaking free, let's go ahead and open up the mystery bag. Don't see no reason why we shouldn't open it up right now. Yeah, they tie the strings extremely tight on these mystery bags sometimes. It's very difficult to get them open. So I'm going to open it up like right here. Oh my goodness, you see that? That humongous tower on the pusher's going. Oh nice, that was a good push on the right side also. So let's see what we got. Oh my goodness, wow. That's right there is what we needed. That ginormous tower on the left just fell toward the center. Couldn't have fell in a better spot, so... Oh my goodness, wow, this mystery bag was loaded up super good. We got three more of the white dice. We got that red earbud, like I was saying. So this means the exact same thing as the $5 chip. We'll get to turn that in. They'll put them two towers into the playing field somewhere. We got another one-ounce gold bar and uh, 15 grand in chips. Let's check both sides. Yeah, it's 15 grand right there. So that is not bad, not bad at all. That uh, mystery bag was loaded up super good. Yeah, I can't believe we won this many uh, white dice today. That is insane. This is definitely going to be a humongous win today. Yeah, we've already won like 11 or 12 of the white dice. So if we can pull like, let's say, at least 15, 20 million in chips out of there. And uh, all those white dice treat us good and win on some phenomenal numbers. And yeah, we could potentially make close to a billion dollars off of this game today. That would be the best case scenario, so, uh, but I mean, that really just depends on what the dice land on. I don't really have any control over what they land on and stuff. We just got to uh, roll them on out to that lower shelf, and it's really just like luck, I guess. Depends if you're lucky enough to get them to land on some good numbers. Oh yeah, well that tower on the pusher is about to go. Wow, look at all those chips we're getting in the center. Now right, let's get that loot chute emptied out again. Yeah, that's going to give us probably a thousand or more extra quarters. That big old tower on the pusher. Oh yeah, nice. There we go. That was a bunch of chips we just got in the middle there. Alright, let's put a bunch more quarters in there. Let's see what all that does. That's a lot of money about to go right there. Come on, big push! And them two gold towers, they're still barely moving even though they uh, rearranged them, so... I don't know what to say about those towers. Oh yeah, that tower's going to go, I think. Alright, let's use that skill stop button again. Load this thing up with quarters. So uh, hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video today. Let's see if we can get to uh, 7,000 likes on this video. 7,000 likes. I know that's a pretty large amount of likes, but I really, really have confidence in you all that we can get there. 
Yeah, if we can get to 7,000 likes uh, in 24 hours of this video being posted tomorrow, I will try a limited quarter game. It might be a one quarter challenge, five quarter challenge, ten quarter challenge. No less than a ten quarter challenge, though. I mean, no more than a ten quarter challenge. It's either going to be a ten quarter challenge, five quarter challenge, or a one quarter challenge. Nice, there it goes. I think the tower on the pressure it's about to go. Now that's going to give us thousands of quarters. It's guaranteed, pretty much. Alright, let's rapid fire this last basket of quarters in there. Oh yeah, we're going to get it this time, I believe. So there it is. Let's see what it does. Oh my goodness, that tower's severely close to going. Alrighty, I'm back. So I have no clue what happened, but the camera cut out on me there for a few minutes. I have no idea when the last uh, time y'all heard me talk. But anyway, this great big old tower is so close to going. Uh, let's just push right there in the center and try to get it to go. We don't really have that many quarters. Oh my goodness, nice, it's going. It lost the chip at the base of it. Oh yeah, we're going to get it any moment, I think. Come on, big push, give me something. Nice, there it goes. It's teetering back and forth. Nice, there we go. Look at all those quarters we got. That was insane. Holy guacamole. Wow, look at all that money. Yeah, and there's a whole bunch of chips behind the uh, basket right here, so pretty sure that basket is going to prevent all those chips from falling out of there. So, honestly, right now, uh, well, I tell you what, let's just put the rest of these quarters in here. And then uh, I'll call them back here, and I'll turn in that red earbud, and they'll take that basket out of there. And I'll also put those two towers in here. Yeah, we might be able to get some of them chips out of there, I guess. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see. Oh, yeah, you see that? You can kind of see through that basket a little bit. The chips are uh, falling out from underneath of that basket, which is a good thing. And that basket being stuck out there might help us get the two golden towers. Alrighty, I'm back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that red earbud, and they took that basket out of there for me, and they put the two towers that was on the blue shelf into the playing field. And uh, looks like they just took all the gold and all that stuff. They combined it into a brand new tower back there. So. I wish me the best of luck. Hopefully we can win all that stuff out of there. Also going to try to win all these quarters back while we can. Yeah, and I can see the $25,000 chips are inside of that great big old tower back there. So, uh, hopefully we can win all that. Wow, that was some nice win right there, baby. Wow, that was a ton of gold we just got. Also, a whole bunch of $25,000 chips. All right, so let's just push all that gold out of there. We'll be ready to uh, cash out. Oh yeah, this is doing miraculously well. We're definitely going to be rich today, that's for sure. Yeah, I don't suggest you ever play this games if you find one of them. Yeah, you could really, really lose a ton of money playing these, I'm telling you. And I've definitely lost way more money at these than I'll probably ever win back, so... Yeah, just take my advice and uh, don't do, like, large buy-ins. I mean, you can play them if you really want to, but 
just be really, really careful. When I first started playing these, I was doing like small buy-ins and stuff. I didn't start off with like one million dollar buy-ins or anything like that. So anyhow, we got it all cleared out of there today. That is absolutely exceptional. It's been an excellent game today. So anyhow, I'm going to go ahead and call them back here. I think we have won 21 dice in total. We got uh, 15 of the white dice, uh, 5 of the golden dice, and 1 silver dice. They'll put all 21 of them dice on the pusher. And we got to roll them on out to that lower shelf. Whatever they all end on, we're going to get the multiplier winnings in their golden quarters by those numbers. So let's call them back here and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So this right here is where the magic is about to begin. You're about to see all those millions of dollars we won get multiplied by a whole bunch potentially. Oh my goodness, they're doing pretty good so far. We got two threes, a six. Oh nice, we got a four and a two. But like I was telling y'all earlier, the ones do not count at all. So if you see any ones, just pretend they don't exist. Yeah, I think that uh, that's right there, the one that had the quarter on top of it. Yeah, it's a one. My goodness, the other ones are doing amazing though. Absolutely amazing. And uh, if any of the dice fall over the edge or down the gutters, we'd end up losing them. I tell you what, let's just try to push that one down the gutter. That way uh, somebody else will get it whenever they win the $50 chip. Just going to try to push on that right hand side. Well see, I'm worried we're going to lose those dice right there in the center. So we really need that dice to fall down in the gutter. Oh my goodness, let's try one more push. Because that could potentially make somebody else millions up on millions of dollars oh my goodness you kidding me it still didn't fall down in there all right let's see what that does come on push that dice down the gutter all right there we go we're definitely going to have to stop right there no we don't need a second wave yeah look at how close that dice is to falling over the edge that is crazy so anyhow uh it's not bad not bad at all the majority of those dice landed on some fabulous numbers so i'm gonna count everything up multiplier winnings in their golden quarters ball that and i'll let y'all know how much money we've made today from a seven million dollar buy-in we'll be right back you all are not going to believe how much money i've won today this is absolutely insane i ended up winning 23 million one hundred and forty five thousand dollars in chips and all the white dice today totaled up to 51, so I'm going to get to multiply my winnings by 51. And in total, I ended up winning $1,180,395,000 from a $7 million buy-in. Oh my goodness, we hit the mega jackpot on this one. This was almost a brand new record win. Yeah, my record win was like a little over 1.3 billion, almost 1.4 billion. So that was like a couple million dollars away, a couple hundred million dollars away from a brand new record win. That is just crazy. Holy cow, I am absolutely shocked right now. I was not expecting to make anywhere near that amount of money today. That is just crazy. Oh my goodness, yeah, we got super, super lucky on this game right here. So I guess we proved the manager wrong on this game. We ended up winning a lot more money than he was expecting us to win. So that is absolutely phenomenal. And uh, anyway, moving on, we also won 241 ounces of gold. And all the gold dice totaled up to 9, so I'm going to get to multiply the gold by 9. And in total, I ended up winning 2,169 ounces of gold today. And uh, the spot price of gold is like 2,030 an ounce, so that means we got an extra $4,403,070 in gold. That is absolutely marvelous right there. And uh, last but not least, we ended up winning 3,219 quarters. And that silver dice landed on a two, so we're going to get to multiply the quarters by two. And in total, I ended up winning 6,438 quarters. Let's divide that by four to get the dollar amount means we got an extra $1,609.50 in quarters. That is absolutely brilliant right there. So anyhow, that is not bad, not bad at all for a $7 million buy-in. So if y'all enjoyed today's video, be sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and uh, enable that bell icon. That way you're notified for whenever I post a brand new video. And uh, if you want to check out a whole entire playlist of my videos, that will appear at the bottom right of the screen. If you want to check out yesterday's video, the previous video, that will appear at the bottom left of the screen. 
And if you want to check out one of Coin Pressure's videos, that will appear at the top left of the screen. And lastly, if you want to subscribe to my channel and check out some of my other videos, you can click that button at the top right of the screen. So with all that being said, I'll see everybody on the next video. Y'all take care and have an awesome day.